The Rope Man 2 versus The Rope Man 1. I'm Sean McVeigh with Sean's Outdoor Adventures and in this video I'm going to show you the difference between The Rope Man 2 and The Rope Man 1 and I did not realize this key difference before purchasing The Rope Man 2. I had The Rope Man 1. Let me just show you the difference and talk about why use one over the other. So for years I've used The Rope Man 1. It's worked extremely well. The teeth on the um, grabber piece on this uh, is fairly uniform across and in the same direction. The teeth on the Rope Man 2 is little tiny um, sort of jagged looking teeth. It's not rows and across like the other one. The Rope Man 1 is rated for uh, 10 millimeter to 13 millimeter climbing rope. The Rope Man 2 is 8 millimeter to 13 millimeter. So it has a large, larger range of ropes that it can be used on. So for years I've used my tethered, um, my tethered Phantom saddle and the ropes that came with the, the saddle. So this is the, um, the lineman's rope. And I'm not sure the exact diameter. It's at least probably, it's probably around 11 millimeters, something like that. The Rope Man 1 is what I've always used on this. So it's just a matter of spreading it open, putting it on the uh, rope, and then you put your carabiner through. Now it's on. So it can slide easily. The rope can slide easily through that direction, not in the other. And then to go in the other direction, you just pull the metal piece here and slide it. So it works very well with the Rope Man 1. Do the same thing with the Rope Man 2. Open it up, put it through, stick a carabiner through, like so. So it slides through very easily. Now for going back the other direction, when, the, when you need to use the metal thing to pull this back, they say it's, it's more or less like a two-hand operation. These little things grab, especially with the ropes that you get from like the tethered guys. Ugh, it's tough. You must got to put your thumb in there, try to peel it back, push it down. It wants to hang up. So it can be very frustrating. I got the, the Rope Man 2 because I just got some 9mm rope from Eastern through Eastern Woods Outdoors for some projects. And um, so you can't use the Rope Man 1. It, only, it starts at 10 millimeters and up. So that is very frustrating for a lot of people. I was not actually aware of that before purchasing it. Some people for the shorter diameter or the smaller diameter, they get the Conduct. It's a little bit more expensive. And also this hop pops right onto the rope. Whereas the Conduct, you actually have to take the end of the rope and feed it through. Where's the other end of this thing? So like you take the end and you have to feed it through. So you have to be committed to it staying on, putting it on and keeping it on throughout the use of that rope. Whereas the uh, Rope Man 1, you know, you can just add it at any time. You just, you know, pop the carabiner on and off, you know, and you're good to go. So you don't have that versatility with the conduct. But all in all, the Rope Man 2 with those little jagged... Uh, things there a lot of people don't like that and I was not aware of that before purchasing it will I keep it um well here's the nine millimeter rope which is what I bought it for it's a um you know it's a firmer rope than the uh this stuff here you know it hangs up and catches a lot easier on that so let's try it on on this rope here Yeah, it definitely hangs up and gets caught. So it's going to be, a lot of people get frustrated by it. Which is what I've learned in reading some reviews after getting it. See that it doesn't want to come out too easily right there. So when it comes to your smaller diameter ropes, the Rope Man 2, a lot of people don't like it because it hangs up. 
some people also say that it wears, you know, wears out your ropes quicker. So that's the difference though, Rope Man 1 versus Rope Man 2. I hope you found this video helpful. Also, if you've been following my videos, you know I'm giving away a Miracle X10 Olympic style recurve bow. I'm giving away an Ultimate Predator Stalker decoy, Gray Fox game cart. Make sure you go to the giveaways page of my website to get the details on that. Until then, take care and God bless.